You can put them on if you want. Make myself look important. You are important. Only 83 subscribers. Oh, hey, crap. It's something. <laughs> Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a special guest, Mr. White Wolf, aka Joey. Really? Oh, I'll call her back. So in today's video we're gonna be showing you what type of <laughs> what type of equipment we use to uh, film our YouTube videos. But uh, he uses separate type of equipment to film his videos, and then I use uh, equipment that I've kind of like stumbled upon the past few years just trying to figure out what I need. I'm very simplistic and I'm very minimal so um, I like to just use things that I actually need and don't uh, really like to get extra stuff that I don't need uh, mm -hmm. that I won't be using. You too right? You yeah. like to just get stuff that you need? Because everybody <laughs> needs a GoPro and I like to shoot little film so yeah I guess I buy the things I need which I haven't bought anything. <laughs> Maybe my earbuds. <laughs> <laughs> so he's invested a total of like $20. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. That's funny. Christmas and birthdays, I guess, so. Do these glasses Charger. do something? I mean, they have like... It says panda. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I tried to be a DJ one time. Oh, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> that was only a few months ago. <laughs> that was my first song. All right. Well, it was a good song. So let's get started with the first item. Why don't you go first, since I always go first on my own channel. First, we got... The GoPro here for, I think, the five. It's a five. <laughs> and uh, pretty much, yeah, I love this because I just, I sometimes use it for vlogging. I take it anywhere when I vlog. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be using it in Florida, in New York. Oh, that's right, because we're going to Florida. Florida, you'll see that vlog. So, oh, wait, 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 but we have to know the price point. Oh, this is $3.99. <laughs> only $3.99. <laughs> only. That's a really good camera for what type of stuff? Action. Action stuff, so um, not for the type of person that wants to film, like, makeup videos or, or style. Well, I mean, you could, but, I mean, it's just... You could just get any other camera for yeah. that. <laughs> like my channel, it's like fashion, social media, music. I, I'm still gonna do traveling videos. I'm still gonna travel, so I still might need something like that if I'm gonna do something more adventurous for the channel. So definitely get yourself one of those if you're gonna do that type of stuff. Uh, so my first item is um, the camera, which you've seen on my channel before, Nikon uh, D3300. Um, this is a separate lens that I bought, but it comes with the actual lens. 18 uh, to 55 millimeter, uh, 1.3, uh, 5. Uh, I bought the separate one because I wanted a, um, I wanted more of a cinematic type of look. So um, I got that, and it also comes with this like little hood, which I like to keep on it because it makes it look better and also keeps any sunlight and other stuff out of the way. This one is a little bit expensive. It was about nine something, but that was in total with the with the next lens. So I think by itself it would have been like six or 700, which is not that that expensive. But it was a good investment and I use it for a lot of stuff, for photos, stuff like that. I used to use it for video, but now I use this one, which um, I'm filming on right now. And it's the uh, uh, Canon G7X, which a lot of YouTubers use this one. I thought I'd use a uh, pretty generic, like popular camera just to kind of like get some good footage for this channel. Of course, those come with chargers and stuff. A little baggie for the lens. Show us your other camera. It's, it's Japanese. Oh, Bestiker. Okay. Bestiker. I think it's Japanese. I had to buy it. Oh, I didn't buy this. <laughs> I found it at the store. <laughs> and it's really good for like little films. The colors are trash. <laughs> I'm just gonna say right now, the colors are trash. Really? So I wouldn't really recommend it. But it would be probably be a good camera like for somebody to start off with. Is it how much was yeah, it? Yeah, it's like two ninety nine. Oh well that's not bad for I mean that it flips out so it's good if you're like kind yeah. of like wanting to see what you're filming too. Right. That's a good starter, like it's all under three hundred, you have the mic, you have the the uh, camera and then you have like the flip out which that's what every youtuber wants is a flip out so they can see what they're filming i'm sure you film stuff and then you're like it's out of focus the whole yeah, time yeah i'm like <laughs> i've done that many times with this camera so that's why i opted to get this one so uh back to i guess my equipment i have a little stand uh, that i use sometimes when i'm lazy right now i'm using like my big stand i got that one for about twenty dollars at best buy uh, when i bought my camera but uh, this one is good for like desktop 
top like you know to get on top of your desk or on top of a few books <laughs> um, or I even hold it like this you know and then kind of use it but he also has this other cool one which you can put on a mirror which you should show so this is you can stick it on a mirror it's for more for beauty uh, channels channels I don't, I don't know why it came with a GoPro it, it doesn't <laughs> oh, even it did? yeah it doesn't oh. even go on the GoPro oh. but it goes on to this camera that I vlog with I, I use it just like in case in case you need to hang up a coat. So this is the uh, PowerShot G7 series. It zooms up to 200 times, 50 times with the lens, and then another 150 times digitally. So here, let me show you. Uh huh. Oh wow. Focus. There you go. That's an amazing. This is my favorite camera I've ever gotten, hmm. ever. It's but just it's really nice. Yep. So you and this is what you vlog with too, right? Yeah, it's what I vlog with like, hey, what's up? In fact, um, <laughs> today in this video, we are um, going to Chuck E. Cheese. We're going to have a good time. <laughs> it's like $300 or something like that. 300 That's a good starter camera too. Yeah, it's a, uh, well, say. maybe not starter, but. Next level. Next level. But you, you need like a different, like you need like a separate audio mm -hmm. if you want like better audio. Yeah. But it's still got really good audio. Let's okay. talk about lights. Oh. Because a lot of people so uh, always wonder about lights because uh, sometimes um, it's either too dark or you miss the sun. Like today we missed the sun so we're filming with a light. Um, so I have two of these. I actually got these for $60 which is really, really affordable. And I'm trying to really show it. but um, So that's how it looks. Um, you put the bulb which they come with um, in the center and then you cover it with the soft uh, box which um, it actually comes with a sheet which I don't know where it's at. It comes with this which you uh, get to store them in here so they don't get ruined. Um, I got them about a year ago and they've lasted ever since and I use them quite often too. So um, The cord, the only complaint that I have is the cord isn't long enough. Um, I always have to use an extension cord but if you don't care about using extension cords and you're okay with uh, with having to kind of like struggle to make it <laughs> uh, reach whatever you're trying to film, then then it should be fine. Road mic, um, I got this for about 250 days, almost 300. Um, I got it in New York at a uh, music store. Um, my friend recommended it to me, um, and uh, yeah, it's I use it to do covers, and I also use it to sometimes record um, audio, like voiceovers. Uh, nowadays, since I learned that, that the iPhone records uh, voiceovers really well, I don't really do it on this anymore. But I use this for covers definitely, along with GarageBand and some other editing software on my Mac, and yeah. Mm -hmm. That's pretty much everything that I use. It's, I have very little. Uh, you know, like, that's <laughs> the one thing that he bought. My teacher said, do you think math doesn't involve YouTube? And then everybody in class said yes. Because <laughs> <Yes. laughs> she has like no idea what it takes. It doesn't involve that much I'm math. I'm trying to think of like what Maybe would like involve math. Counting your books. Or but, like... like you... <laughs> I never use math. Well, at least for YouTube. Maybe like the analytics. Uh, yeah, but, but like, I mean, just to read that, but it tells you everything. Yeah, it, it tells, tells you how you, many people viewed it, how many people, tells you for it. how much time they they viewed it for. It does work with percentages sometimes, so that can be a little. Yeah, she spe like she like found out that I had a YouTube channel, and then she mm -hmm. specifically said to me, "Do you think that math doesn't involve YouTube?" <laughs> and then everybody was just like, "Yes." <laughs> <laughs> so that is pretty much it, guys. We hope you guys enjoyed the video and found it helpful. If you did find it helpful, definitely give us a thumbs up and let us know what you think in the comments down below and you will see me in the next video and see him in our next collab. So, I'll see you guys in the next video.